this is going to be an emergency Shohei Otani segment. So I know it's not the typical Tuesday, but let's get the graphics in the wall. Let's talk some Shohei Otani because Shohei Otani just put together the greatest back-to-back -back nights in MLB history. What he did on Tuesday, what he did on Wednesday, we have never in the history of baseball seen greater back-to-back -back games than what Shohei Otani did those two nights. Let's talk about it. Let's first talk about Tuesday night. Offensively, Shohei Otani comes up earlier in the game. They're down 6-1 to one at the time. Hits a no-doubt massive home run deep to right field. Absolutely crushed it. Okay, three-run homer. Later in the game, comes up in the ninth inning, down three runs, and you just kind of got the feeling something cool was going to happen. And guess what? It did. Not only did something cool happen, it sent me going crazy. I was legitimately running around my living room. He hit a three-run homer. He stood there. He watched it. He admired it. It went deep into the night. They tied the ball game. Shohei Otani, another three-run homer. Two three-run home runs in the game. Eight RBIs. Three for four at the plate. An absolutely unbelievable night. Broke his career record for RBIs in the game at eight. Last night, Shohei Otani, as a Tuesday night, set a new career high for RBI in a single game. Babe Ruth's career high for RBIs in a single game was seven. I have been on record many times saying I believe Shohei Otani is better than Babe Ruth. He continues to prove it, and he has proven it over the last couple of nights. So that happens on Tuesday night. Three for four, two three-run homers, eight RBIs. And you knew that this is the starting pitcher on Wednesday night's game. That made it even more incredible. What he had done was the night before a start on the mound. So then guess what? Wednesday comes around. Shohei Otani is on the mound, and he put together a masterful performance. Eight innings, two hits, 13 strikeouts. 13 strikeouts. Shohei Otani put together the most impressive and the greatest back-to-back -back games in the history of Major League Baseball. In history. Think about it. We have never seen what Shohei is doing in baseball before. And then we saw it condensed into two nights. And both were career performances. Eight RBIs, a career high. 13 strikeouts, a career high. Shohei Otani became the first player in history to have eight or more RBIs in one game and 12 or more strikeouts the very next game. And guess what? Not only the first player to ever do it back-to-back -back consecutively, he's also the only player other than one player. There has been one guy in history that has tallied those totals in a career. Eight or more RBIs and 12 strikeouts or more. In a career, Shohei Otani did it in back-to-back -back nights. He also got a 13th strikeout. So he ended up with 13 strikeouts and 8 RBIs. The only player in history to do it in back-to-back -back nights. Let me clarify what I just said so you can really understand it. Because this can be complicated to understand. I, I know that and I had to read this multiple times. He had eight RBIs and 13 strikeouts. Only one other player in history has done that over the course of a career, tallied both of those. Shohei did it in back-to-back -back nights. Incredible. That's why I'm rocking, this is my good luck shirt. This is my good luck Shohei Otani shirt. You know, the picture where I'm going, yeah, 
This is the shirt. I had to wear it. I haven't I don't I don't know if I've worn it, but but and besides for that picture. But here it is. Shohei made me pull it out. This is it. Recognize it? <laughs> Unbelievable. Um, what he what he did the last couple of nights is is the sole reason, and I've said this so many times, I really do get tired of the fact that we just don't talk about it enough. People I don't know I don't know why everybody doesn't talk about Shohei the way I talk about Shohei. I really don't. We are witnessing stuff that not only has never been done before, as in doing it in back-to-back games, he did something in back-to-back games that has literally never been done by a player before in their career. Remarkable. Truly remarkable. On the mound, he retired 23 of his last 24 batters faced. 23 teams have had neither an 8-RBI game at the plate nor a 13-strikeout game on the mound this season. Shohei Otani has had both over a two-game span. He was dominant on the mound, and I actually thought on Wednesday night he would be coming out after the seventh inning. You know who also thought he would be coming out after the seventh inning? His manager, Phil Nevin, was was pulling him out of the game. He said, hey, you're going to be done. Well, that didn't happen. Phil Nevin said Shohei Otani was adamant about going back out for the eighth when he was at 96 pitches. Otani told him, no, this is mine. I had just talked to Phil Nevin last week about managing Shohei, being the new manager of the Angels. He was just on Flippin' Bats a week or so ago. Go back and listen to that episode. You need to hear how he talked about managing Shohei. The biggest key point. He made over and over and over is it is is about communication. It is about trusting each other and having that communication between each other. Shohei Otani comes off after the seventh. Phil Nevin says, you're done. Shohei says, no, this is mine. And he trusted him to go back out there and get it done. CC Sabathia tweeted this. Two home runs and eight RBIs. One night, 13 Ks and two hits allowed the next night with a W. Shohei Otani is ridiculous. So let me continue to break this down for you in another way, okay? And this one is going to get a little analytical, but I have the research and the data to kind of compare so you can really understand what I'm saying. But in the last two, so Tuesday and Wednesday night, Shohei Otani accrued an F war, So F just is the fan graphs. So a war of 1.0. In two nights, he did that. Okay? Just for reference, Pete Rose has an F4 of 80.1 in his entire career. In his entire career. A career spanning 3,562 games. Shohei Otani racked up 180th of his career war in two games. In two games, Shohei Otani racked up an 80th of Pete Rose's career war. Unbelievable. Truly unbelievable. Shout out Foolish Baseball for getting that stat together. Um, but I, I, I really am at a loss for the performance that we just saw. It is historic. It is unhuman like. This we there's a very good chance we never see again what we saw the last two nights from Shohei Otani. There's a really good chance we never see that again. The two home runs that sent me going crazy around my living room, that sent fans around the world going crazy, that even made broadcasters around the world going crazy. Let's check this clip out from the Japanese broadcast and hear their reaction to this home run. Fun fact, that was also me in my living room watching all of that go down. (laughs) 
I what an absolutely incredible performance. Performances. So now entering today, Shohei Otani ranks in the top ten in the American League in home runs, RBIs, pitching strikeouts, and wins on the mound. <laughs> this is remarkable. It is historic, and it has never been done before in the history of baseball. And I don't know if it ever will. And it allowed me to do two Shohei Otani episodes in one week. The typical Otani segment comes on Tuesdays. Guess what? We had to do it in full force today, an emergency Shohei Otani segment because he's just that good. Absolutely incredible and a remarkable couple of nights that just showcases the legend that he is. And I don't say that lightly, but I will end with this. Tuesday and Wednesday night, back to back, are the greatest two consecutive nights in Major League Baseball history. There's been guys that have hit four, five, six home runs in back to back nights. There's guys that have pitched and had 13 strikeouts, 20 strikeouts in one game, but guess what? They weren't pitching two games in a row. We just saw a guy have a career night offensively with eight RBIs, a career night pitching-wise with 13 strikeouts and no runs in eight innings, and we saw it happen on back-to-back nights, something that has never been done before in the history of baseball, and no player in the history of baseball, has both of those things under his belt. Eight or more RBIs, as well as 13 or more strikeouts. Shohei is all alone there. He is a legend. He is the legend. He is the face of baseball. And that, my friends, is the legend of Shohei Otani. Thanks for watching. If you love flipping bats, swinging 3-0, or just talking ball, join us. Call us at 213-537-9339 with your questions. We have a weekly guest, and we have a lot of fun, so hit that subscribe button.